What's up, everybody? You're watching the Game Dad play Mario and Rabbit Sparks of Hope. Super excited to be bringing you this game. Thank you so much to everybody who's been watching and supporting my channel so far. Let's get into it, guys. Okay, here we go. Celebration in the Mushroom Kingdom. There's Peach's Castle. <laughs> There's the rabbits. They're everywhere. <laughs> One's just face down in a bush. Oh, look at this. A rabid Donkey Kong. Rabid Gorilla. A Brontosaurus. Hey, it's Peach. Hey, Princess Peach. So it looks like she's waiting for somebody. She says, Mario, Rabbit Peach, Beepo, I'm so relieved to see you. The rabbits are especially exuberant today. Somebody has misplaced Rabbit Mario's overalls. Uh oh, he's hiding in the bush. They're missing, and he's too embarrassed to come out from that bush he's hiding in. Ooh. Oh, if I catch the thief who took my overalls, where are they? <laughs> Can you please look and find Rabbit Mario's overalls? Try checking the trees or the bushes. Consider it done, my beloved princess. We are happy to serve. Oh, Beepo's voice acted. Awesome. So this is called an overall nice day. Find Rabbit Mario's overalls. So that's our goal here. Oh, here we go. Oh, we got Rabbit Peach with us too. Let's get some coins and let's do some exploring. Let's talk to this one. People always say to me, Move right control stick to look around. No idea why. Well, because it helps me. Ever heard of the phrase, hold X to boost? Makes no sense to me, but what do I know? Oh, so we could run faster if we hold X. It's Luigi. Those aren't rabid Mario's for sure, but I smell something fishy. These overalls are mine. Check the size on the tag if you don't believe me. <laughs> we could shake this tree. Hey, we got some coins. More coins. Maybe it's like hidden in a bush somewhere. Oh, we just bonked into a bush, into a rock. Oh, this, look at this bush. It's sparkling. I bet this is where they're hidden. It is. Oops. There we go. We got him. So where is Peach? And Rabid Mario. Yay! Here they are. Ah! Whoa! Oh, oh we didn't. Dr I thought maybe we would have dropped them. All right, let's give them to him. Hurry, hand me my overalls. There we go. I'm a back. Ta-da! Back in business. <laughs> Everybody, everybody's together now. Oh, you found your overalls, Rabbit Mario. I knew I should have hit him somewhere else. Oh, it was Rabbit Luigi. <laughs> Rabbit Mario says, Ah, uh, yes. You want to be just like Rabbit Mario, but only one of us can look this good in casual alternatives to pants. <laughs> <laughs> All's well that ends well. Now we can enjoy this beautiful day in peace and harmony. Oh, that's just like Princess Peach to say. Beepo says. We can now kick back and relax, safe in the knowledge that everything is under control. Good idea, Beepo. Let's relax. <laughs> There's a cutscene. What's this? Ah! Is that a Luma? It is. It's a rabid Luma. <laughs> Uh-oh. Whoa, what is this thing? He's gonna hit the castle. Oh, he covered it in black stuff. Black goo. Get off your phone, Peach! <laughs> That's the problem with the world today. Oh, no! It took her! She's stuck in the goo. Let's go save her. 
Oh, give me a boost. Give me a boost. Boom. We're in. Whoa, it took us to like another world here. What's going on here? There she is. All right, we got to save Rabid Peach, guys. Oh, here we go. From cover to cover, it's called. We got to reach that area. Oh, there's some bad guys. All right, here we Don't go. Don't panic, Rabbit Peach. We'll just stroll casually along the back of this flying creature and reach your location in no time. Uh-oh. Strike the words casual, stroll, and don't panic. we got hostiles incoming. Uh-oh. Hostiles. Mario, take cover and don't get caught out in the open. Move from cover to cover and remember to attack. So we got to move from cover to cover and remember to attack. So this says... Take cover. Get behind cover to protect your hero from enemies. While taking cover, you can aim with ZL at enemies and then hit them while remaining protected. Okay. Oh, look. We could just free move here. Okay. So now we're in cover. Let's aim. So dual slinger. Uh, fires two projectiles either at one target or two separate ones. Confirm the first target to select a second. So this is my first target. And then we'll select this for a second. There we go. Put a hurt on each of them. Uh-oh. They're coming at us now. Oh, he blew our cover. All right, let's see. Let's get behind. Oh, we can't move that far. Maybe we could go from here. Boom. That should take him out. Can we hit this guy? I don't think we're going to hit him, though. Okay, he's going to try and shoot us, and he's going to miss. Rabbit Peach is within reach. Focus on getting to her now by moving to the tip of the manta's tail. Yeah, but I want to take this guy out, too. I think we could get him. Got him. Woohoo! <laughs> All right, we made it to the tip of the tail. Oh man, she's just hanging by a thread here. Did she fall? Oh, she's out. Nice landing, Rabbit Peach. Uh oh, more bad guys. Uh oh, one of my guns is busted. Hers is busted too! Tough egg to crack, this, this level's called. We gotta destroy the Manta's weak points, so they must be these uh, squiddy looking eye things. Alright, guys. Rabbit Peach, you're safe! Despite the mysterious malevolent energy sabotaging our weapons! Neutralizing our weapons? Ha! We'll simply rely on our powerful dash move that has saved the day for us during many a battle. So Peach has a powerful yeah. dash move, huh? Using dash, we can jar those egg-like things loose once they're in your possession. Once they're in our possession, you they'll what? You can them at the creature's orb-shaped eyeball protuberances. It's weak spots. Ah, we can throw them at the eyeballs. Okay, here we go. So we could dash through this, pick it up, and let's throw it at this guy's eye. Booyah, got him. So we got nowhere to really take cover. I guess we could just press uh, Y and let it be the enemy's turn. Oh wait, there's a guy in the middle here. So let's get behind cover. Okay, now let's let it pass the enemy's turn. Mario took a hit. Oh, I wonder if I could have let Mario go, too, before. Yeah, I think I could have. Oops. Okay, now we're in cover. Now we'll pass it to the enemy.
So we don't have our the guns yet, right? Is beyond that gap. We'll need to find a way to get over it. Time for some team jumping. Oh, team jumping. So this says, uh, use the team jump to reach the last darkness, dark mess egg. During a team jump, your heroes are free to move around while in the air. Just be aware of the timer. Gather your heroes close to perform a team jump. By standing still next to another hero, you can reveal their maximum team jump distance. When a hero enters into another hero's area of movement, this area will be highlighted in yellow, and the shoe icon for the ladder will be highlighted as well. Okay, so we'll see some uh, indications that we could do a team jump. Oh, it says it too. Here we go. Got it. Hashtag winning. <laughs> Hashtag winning. Sweet. We got all the bad guys off his back. Uh-oh. We're going in for a crash landing. Nice landing, Mario. <laughs> Peach, not so much. She's good, though. Okay. We're in for a battle here. Gun no worky. Oh, he's got some magic. He fixed it! This rabid Luma's got some uh, powers, some magic powers. Pretty cool. Okay, shot in the dark mess, this one's called. Defeat them all. We gotta defeat all these bad guys. Our weapons have been reactivated. Time to take cover, take aim, and fire at those baddies. Just beware that this dimension works quite differently than our own. You cannot move after you shoot. So we can't move after we shoot. Okay, when an enemy is behind partial cover, we have a 50% chance to hit them. Percentages will appear along your intended line of fire. Oh, I see. It shows it on the top next to the, their health. Some weapons can bypass partial cover to hit an enemy when they're behind them. So maybe it looks like Peaches might be able to. Remember, after you shoot, you can't move anymore, so be sure to take cover first. Okay. So first, let's take cover. And we'll press his EL. How do we switch enemies again? Oh, there we go. Can I shoot the same guy twice? Looks like I can. Oh, we got him with both. Took him out, guys. Nice. Now let's get Peach. Okay, now ZL. Oh, she's got rockets. She's got like a rocket launcher. Oh, we got a bad guy shooting at us. Peach could get him. Peach is awesome. Rabbit Peach is awesome. Look at her go. Got him. Flawless victory. Oh man, we got like a a void opening up behind us here. Oh man. This guy's huge. What is this thing? It's not Bowser, it's something else. Goombas. How'd they get up here? They don't like them either. Uh-oh, he's hypnotizing them. They're coming at us. So this guy could, like, uh, hit, take over people and have them come after us. All right, we got to defeat all the bad guys in this one, too. Oh, man, we got a lot of Goombas coming at us. Starburst says, That vicious, horrible monster is Cursa. We barely escaped it. 
Now it won't stop chasing us. <gasps> this cursor is well out of range. Yet the energy readings I'm picking up from it are beyond my ability to measure. I can help. I can give Mario the ability to power up his attacks. It'll even have the same effect on his friends. We'll take all the help we can get. Mario, be sure to see what this new ability of yours can do. Speaking of abilities... Remember that both of you have your signature techniques at your disposal. I have a feeling you're going to need them. Signature techniques. Now that you can choose between attack and techniques. Oh, so if we press ZR, we can select uh, techniques and sparks L. Remember that each er hero has two action points per turn. Don't forget about dash. These, these moving abilities do not consume action points, but they have their own counters. To reach a better position, remember that you can use the team jump. It's a movement ability. It does not consume action points, but they have their own counters. Okay, so I see the arrow and the dash has counters above your abilities. Okay, so what if we dash through these guys? Look at that. All right, now let's hide behind here. Um, oh, I know who I'm going to shoot at with Mario. This guy that's out in the open. I'm going to shoot him twice. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, now, Peach, can I go to cover the same spot? No, but I can go behind this. And take this guy down. Here we go. Good start to the battle. Um... We have another action we could do? Oh, we can't do ZL. What's ZR do for her? It looks like maybe some kind of healing technique. And Mario can do... What's this? Hero Sight. Targets moving within range. And the hero's line are dealt a plus 100% damage plus any super effects. Oh, so this is what's going to increase our damage. Sweet. All right. Let's switch to the enemy's turn now. Oh, look at that. We took one out. Oh, they got Peach. Ouch. This guy's moving. Okay, they're both behind cover now. Now that's just partial cover. Okay, Mario, let's dash through these guys. And what does the Luma do? Dual Slinger fires two projectiles. Oh wait, that's not the Luma. This is the Luma. Turbo Charge, allies within range deal 20% more damage with attacks and movement abilities. Okay, so him, I'm going to actually, let's see, do we want to go back and cover? Let's stay in cover, and let's shoot at this guy. Maybe it'll at least bust down this um, to partial cover. Yep. Perfect. So he's going to stay here. Peach, you dash. Let's take this guy out. Booyah. Way to go, Rabbit Peach. Um, she could heal. Heal 20% HP. <laughs> Sweet! Oh, he shot at us. Did he hit us? I don't think it, I don't think it got us. Get him! Boom! Battle's cleared. Oh, we're getting experience points now. And we got some coins and star bits. All right. What was this thing's name again? Cursa? He's got an evil eye. 
What is that? Who is this? Oh, it's the team. All right, they saved us. I think we were in trouble there. Oh man, he's got a huge hand. That was close. That was close. All right, now we're in a spaceship. We have our own spaceship. Awesome. Who's this guy? Welcome, Mario and Rabbit Peach. It is fortunate that you are unharmed. Your safety is critical to our mission. Ah, the, the name is Genie. Hey, hello. Remember me, the entity who created you? I'm alive too. Also fortuitous, but with a critical success factor that is lower in comparison by 31.732193%. <laughs> Genie's good at math. <laughs> Forgive Genie here for her arrogance, everyone. As the ship's new artificial intelligence, she just became self-aware yesterday. Obviously, I have a lot more testing to do, but seeing as how we're an emergency situation here, I, uh... Hey, it's Luma. Little fella? Hey, little fella. Aren't you sparkly? Did you come on board with Mario? Interesting. It appears that this creature is equal parts rabid and luma. It contains a massive amount of harnessable energy as a result. Cool. I suspect there are more of them scattered throughout the galaxy, though without more data, the exact number cannot be determined. It's hmm. a rabid luma. <gasps> hmm. How could this have happened? Rosalina would never have allowed this. She's in trouble because of Cursa. Please help her. Please. No. Oh, no. Rosalina, something terrible must have happened. Cursa is conquering the galaxy using a corruptive energy called Darkness. I can pinpoint the epicenter of this activity, Cursa's stronghold. It will take our ship an eternity to travel the distance between our current location and the stronghold. However, using a purified form of darkness energy, we could create a series of warp tunnels that would make such travel almost instantaneous. Oh, so we could travel like fast travel. Just what I was about to suggest to our friend here. Hmm, what do we call your kind? Aha! How about rabid lumas? Hey, good idea. That's what I was calling. <laughs> Oh, someone said sparks. Really? Because objectively speaking, I think Rabbit Lumas is kind of perfect. I know? agree, Beepo, but sparks is kind of cool. <laughs> Rabbit Mario says, it stinks. The closest planet within range is Beacon Beach. The dark mess has already spread there. Not enough data to define the level of danger. Okay, so Beacon Beach has some dark mess Please, there. Please, Genie, adventure may be new to you, but not to us. I expect the level of difficulty of this mission to be... Oh, is this letting us pick our difficulty level? Let's go with average. Of course I reserve the right to change my mind at any point during our mission. Regardless, with the rabid Loomis behind us, the rocky road ahead will be made just a little smoother. I believe the consensus was sparks. Yeah, it's, they're called sparks now, Beepo. Get over it. No, whatever. What matters <laughs> is we have the help. Listen, now that Cursor knows they're with us, I bet it will never bother us again. Oh, man, this thing is... This thing is evil, man. What's this behind him? Is it a bad guy? Uh-oh, bad guys. Cursa says, I need the energy of those creatures. Bring them to me. Uh-oh. This guy's bad. Oh, look at this. Look at this area. Looks cool. Oh. 
It's all rainy and dark here. Beacon Beach, it's called. Oh, yeah. You can see the dark mess there. It's taking over that tower. Hey, this is like in... Uh, looks like one of those Bowser Fury towers, doesn't it? From uh, Super Mario 3D World, Bowser's Fury. It looks just like one. The light tower, that's what it was. Ah, what's this? Hmm? <laughs> what's going on here? Oh, it's a rabbit. His name's Augie. Out, out, out. If you're here to cause trouble, we're at our limit already. Put that away. We're heroes, not unruly tourists. Heroes? Heroes? You mean like the put ourselves in serious danger to help total strangers kind of heroes? Yep, bingo, that's right, bingo, Augie. Bingo, baby. <laughs> bingo, bango, bamba, bango, baby. Augie's got a prayer. Ha <laughs> ha. Um. <laughs> er, what I mean is, I've got some minor problems I could use help with. See that thing on our lighthouse? The sun disappeared the second it showed up and snuffed out our lighthouse signal fire. That thing is a dark mess tentacle. By eliminating it, not only can we reverse its ill effects on the weather, but we can purify its darkness energy and use it to create a warp tunnel to our next destination. Oh, nice. So we could kill we two birds with one stone. We must also eradicate any and all darkness puddles. They won't yield purified darkness energy, but they are still a threat. So we got to totally clear the dark mess from this area. Uh, we'll, we'll restore this island so. and at the same time, give us a path to the next area. Augie says, um, can you stop by the village first? It's under siege by a horrible menace. Been meaning to get on it for a while. Augie's request is compatible with our mission. I have detected a spark in the village as well. We should make contact. Ooh, a spark's in there. All right, let's head to the village. Spark? spark? That's what you call those little star-shaped creatures? Ah, they could have done both of us a favor and stayed home too. Well, we're all here, but this trouble in the village sounds like a two-hero job, not including myself, of course. Easy as pie. Let's get it over with before my nano dials start to rust. Who's with me? I'm with you, Beepo. Let's do it. Okay, new main quest unlocked. You just unlocked your first quest. Check them on our map. Oh, so you press select uh, the minus button for a map. Here is the next step of our main quest. To check all available quests, press X at any time and open your quest log. Okay. So this is where we are. That's our ship. Arc of Darkness. And this is our Beacon Town objective. Beacon Beach Secret Zone. Ah, it shows us where some secrets are. So there's some challenges too. Level four. Oh, wow. Okay, cool. What's this, coins? We'll have to just stop by and see if we can find those coins, too. You just obtained your first weapon skin. Open the weapon skin page to check it out and equip it. Cool. And we got team heal. Press down to open the team heal page and heal your entire party in exchange for a few coins. This is a service offered by SalesBot999 plus tax. The merchant. Visit him. He also has some very interesting items to sell. So there's a merchant around. So we got to collect coins too. That's for sure. There's our ship on the small little island. Hey, what's this little crab doing? Yo! Oh, some dark mess here. Can we get around it? No. Is there something over there? Hey, what's this? Nothing we could interact with right now, it looks like. What's over here? Oh, we got in a battle. 
Peach is coming too. And Rabbit Luigi. Mamma Mia! <laughs> awesome. Here we go, Beacon Beach, first battle. All right. So this says manage your team. Let's check the team management menu. Inside, you can choose who to bring in your team. So I wonder how many people we could have on our team. Looks like it's just two. Okay, you can browse through your heroes and swap the ones in the team with the ones that joined us. Select your favorite team of heroes without any restrictions. Oh, cool. Luigi's a sneak attacker. Rabbit Luigi's a pest. Peach is a protector. Rabid Mario is a brawler. I like how Rabid Peach can heal and I kind of like where we're at here. Oh, it looks like you could equip different sparks. So this one um, boosts your damage by 20% and reduces damage. This one, 20% of the damage intended for the hero is redirected towards the enemy. Ah. Increases weapon-based attack damage by 10%. I kind of like the Starburst one for now. He's equipped to Mario, though. Oh, this says we can upgrade. Give Star Bits. Oh, you give Star Bits. Gives experience to the Sparks. So that'll increase um, their abilities. Okay. Yeah, let's feed him. Oh, not enough to get him to level two, though. All right, I'm going to leave the team like it is. And we're going to head in. So we could dash, pick up, and throw a bomb to deal a lot of damage. Like, so some area damage. Oh, that's cool. Can I get a bomb, though, from here? No, it doesn't look like it. Not close enough. How many bad guys are there? Is there a way to like see the whole, oh, tactical camera. So there's one here, one here. Oh, here's the other one. I was like, there's, it says there's four. So let's just go here. Or no, we'll go right here. You're done, buddy. Okay, now... Yeah, let's turbocharge. Let's go! Let's go! Alright, now let's go to Peach. Can she get the... Oh, she can get the bomb. Ho-ho, oh, nice! Um, we should probably hide now. Yeah, let's hide here. Oh, we got him with one of our bombs. Nice. Okay. Now I think we need to switch the enemy's turn. Uh-oh. Oh, good. It wasn't enough to hurt us. Oh, he's going to hurt Mario if I shoot him. So we better back off. Let's move Mario first. Yeah, let's move Mario back here. Now we'll go back to her. There we go. Got him. Oh, cool. Looks like you heal a little bit of health, too. Oh, I like that everybody levels up when you level up. Very good. Very cool. Skill prism obtained. You just unlocked your first skill prisms. You can use them in the skill tree to empower your heroes. All right, let's go check it out. 
This is the skill tree. It is used to upgrade your hero's abilities during battles. Skill prisms are the currency you can spend to activate upgrades. Each hero has their own set of skill prisms. They can be used and refunded at any time without cost. You can find the skill tree inside the heroes tab of the team menu. Okay, let's let's go to Mario, see what we can do. We could give him more health. Um, stop. We could give him some extra movement. Increases glide time after a team jump. Critical hit chance. <clears throat> oh, then we could do things like increase our weapon range. Techniques, 15% weapon weapon uh, damage usage. Can we unlock this one? Oh, that takes two skill prisms. Okay. Um, let's do one of these weapon ones. Increases the range of Mario's dual slinger. Increases the chance of a critical hit. I like the idea of increasing the range. So let's do that. Wait, I thought I have a skill prism. Did I use it on something? Oh, I see. You got to use it on the first one first. So I think I bought this one. Okay. We got it. All right. Cool. So that's like an upgrade path. So how do I interact with anything though? Oops. What about if we look at the map, does it show anything here? It doesn't really show anything here, but it really looks like something we should be able to interact with. Maybe we can't do it until we clear the area of bad guys and all the, uh, let's fight this guy. Oops, he got us. So it looks like when we're coming, approaching an enemy in this overworld area, when you're not in a fight, you could dash at him. I wonder if that gives you like a leg up on the battle before you fight. All right, Beacon Beach, second battle. Let's check out the tactic cam. So there's four bad guys in this one again. Oh, I bet getting this bomb might be useful. Okay, here we go. Hurry up, bombs are ticking. There we go. All right, now can we reach Peach with this? Oh, so don't use it yet. I got an idea here. Let's move Peach closer. Right, let's look at the tactic cam. Is there just two left now? Yep, two left. So let's move Peach here. Now let's use our our starburst. Powered him up. Now let's go to Peach and attack. Boom! It's been real. <laughs> it's been real. Uh oh, he's gonna be able to hit us. That was a good hit too. Not as good as this one's gonna be. <laughs> Beat it. Got 10 star bits too. Oh, we should have enough to upgrade our starburst. Okay, so how do I do that again? It's not the map. 
Not this button. I don't know how to do it. Oh, here we go. So now let's go to Sparks. Um, this one. Oh, we could swap this one, give him to Peach. Nice. Now we could upgrade this guy. Sweet. To unlock the next level, at least one hero must reach level nine. So we can't level him up again until he's level nine. This one we could upgrade though. All right, we're starting to figure this game out. Oh, here's a rabbit. Let's talk to him. Please help us. Our village is under siege. Hold X to run to the plaza. Oh, this is the store he was talking about. Big flash sale going on. Says, do my audio visual capacitors deceive me? Or do I see some discerning customers with an eye for quality here? My usual customers, they have what I call value blindness. For them, I put out factory returns, overstock items. Still, they do nothing but haggle over price and badger me over reward points. Me, with six little peddler bots at home, I cannot afford to buy them all shoes, so they have to share. But do I complain? No. I continue to offer amazing deals, such as first time Beacon Beach customers get two free super mushrooms. My loss is your gain, but after this, if you want to fill a full team heal anytime, you'll need to pay, er, anytime except combat. So check your new item bag in the combat, in, uh, in combat, and use an item to boost your strategy. Oh, cool, so we could buy items from this guy. But be wise, as each hero can only use one item per turn, and it costs an action point to use an item. So it's going to cost an action point. So super mushrooms heal us. We already have two of those. Pows unleash a shockwave of damage. Refresh sparks and techniques for immediate use. Level up any spark with this delicious celestial beverage fortified with vitamins and minerals. What is this? Oh, this costs two like suns. I don't think we have any of those, right? No. So the only things that cost coins are these top three. Hmm. This pow looks like it could be pretty useful. Let's buy a pow. And we'll buy a spark refresh. And we'll buy one more mushroom. So that restores 30% of your health points. All right. He says, bring back the family next time. <laughs> Let's see what this rabbit has to say. The village is menaced by something so powerful, no one, no force in the galaxy can stop it. I could stop it. What's oh, this? He's convinced he can cross pollinate a tree with a slice of a double pepperoni to hybridize a pizza palm. Oh, a pizza palm. Oh, makes sense. Yay! It's a pizza tree. Man, I wish I had a tree that could grow pizza on it. What is up here? Let's talk to this guy. I'm keeping an eye on that darkness tentacle. I hear Curso uses them to sap all the energy from the planet. Nasty stuff. Okay, so I still don't see like a way. The bottom rung of darkness. Maybe if we go around, we can get to it. Oh, hey, a red coin ring. Are we being timed here? Got it. Oh, a treasure. Sweet. Planet coin awarded. Okay, so that's what they call those sun coins. Planet coins. What's over here? Well, let's look at the map again. Maybe we'll see something. So it looks like there's a planet coin area here. I wonder if it's a, if you got to do a battle to clear these. It won't stop raining. Please get rid of the tentacle at the lighthouse. These concert tickets cost me a fortune. 
I've been out here for days, but the concert won't start until the weather improves. That curse of ruins everything. Oh man, they're messing up their concert. What's this guy say? No cheap beats for now. My concert is postponed. Oh man. Hey, we found a super mushroom. Cool. All right, let's head over here and clear this uh, dark tentacle stuff if we can. The bottom rung of darkness, it's called. All right, let's head in. Okay, the bottom rung of darkness. Looks like we might have five or six bad guys in this. Oh, eight enemies in this one. All right, let's hit it. So let's, let's look at the tactical cam. So there's two here. Wow. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. These guys want to play hardball, I see now. All right. Well, we're going to start off with doing some boosts. And I'm going to move over here. At least get partial cover, right? Targets moving within range. And the hero's line of sight are dealt 100% damage plus any super effects. Nobody better move in my range, buddy. Or there's going to be some trouble. Okay, so now, now he's going to stay here. Let's stay behind cover. I thought I would be able to shoot. Ugh. Is this count as cover? No. Is this count as cover? No. Yeah, well, we're going to stop him here. Because Peach could shoot over cover. Yeah, let's stop him here. And we'll have Peach go... Maybe a team jump would be useful here? Nah, she, I think she's just better off going right here. All right, first. We'll do, we'll put reflect on. And let's take this guy out. All right, let's switch to the enemy's turn. Oh man, here they come. Hero sight. Ouch! He got us. That one missed. Oh good. That reflection back took that guy out. Uh-oh. Mario got whacked there. Okay, Peachy. Peachy, Peachy, Peachy. Where do we want to send her? I'd like to go after that bomb, but it's going to be tough to reach it. Let's do a team heal. Now let's do an attack. Those are the only guys we could reach. Um, let's get this guy. He's too close for comfort. Oh, we got a critical hit. That took him out. All right, Mario. Let's get up. Oh, no, we can't get all the way up there. So let's get back here by Peach. <laughs> got him. All right, we're going to have to shoot the bomb next time. Oh, 
Uh oh, Peach is exposed. Oh, we won't have to shoot the bomb. We could pick it up and throw it at those three guys. That's going to do a lot of damage. All right, here we go. Here we go. Booyah! That was a good move right there. Took him down. Battle cleared. I thought there was two guys left. I don't know how that happened, but I'm good with that. <laughs> Seemed like a glitch to me, but we got it. Bottom rung of darkness. We got a planet coin for beating that one. We can climb up this ladder. What's this? Another a little robot. Bomb bombs. You just obtained your first memory. Open the memories menu to check it out. Okay, let's see. Bomb bombs roaming around the galaxy are even more dangerous under Curse's influence. Though their modus operandi remains the same, a successful hit will cause one to ignite, while dashing allows heroes to pick them up and use them as explosives. Okay, so this is just like um, like a beastery. They have these in role-playing games to just show you what you know the enemies and parts of the stories do. So you could go in there and read about them if you forget like what something does. Because if you're new to role-playing games like this, you know, sometimes they have a lot, um, you know, a lot of a lot of things to them, and they could get kind of complex. So you could go back to something like that and remember what something does. What's this? It's a locked door. It requires a sunrise key. Oh, that's the secret zone. Okay, so we need to find. Maybe we get the sunrise key after we beat the area. All right, let's head up this way into the town. This is where our main objective is. Help, help. Someone's trapped up there. Maybe that's the spark. Or it's just rabbits. Maybe people in the town that need help. Oh, rabbit Mario's ready to brawl. Uh-oh. Slow motion dash. Kicked him. Nice. So this will give us a leg up on this battle. Oh, man. Look at all these bomb bombs. So this battle is called Explosive Situation. <laughs> I'll say it's an explosive situation. All right. Let's head into battle. Okie dokie. There we go. Oh, that hit me. <laughs> um, let's head back to safety here. Maybe behind here. Let's power up the team. Oh, I could dash again and... Oh, no, I could only dash once. Okay, so now let's... Shoot this guy, yeah. Nice. All right, let's go to Peach now. Let's use our reflect ability. And our team heal ability. Because it looks like if you get hurt in a battle and your health goes down, you carry that forward to the next battle. So we got to keep our health up too. Oh, good. We could throw him at that one. And is there only... Oh, we're out of action. All right, so let's let's take cover here. Oh, we could vault over walls, too. Cool. All right, let's leave it to the enemy turn now. Is it just this one guy left? Good. Hold still, will ya? Hold still, will ya? 
Doki. Battle cleared. We healed some health there too and went up to level three. Nice. Got some coins, some star bits. This game's awesome. So this rabbit says, Nice work getting rid of that bomb bomb. I was worried it'd kaboom that poor creature I found. Oh, he found the, maybe he found the star creature. See, the door to the lighthouse can only be unlocked by the sun. With it gone, we can't get inside. Normally, lucky for you, this clever little critter could make its own light. Watch, I'll show you. <laughs> he looks scared. Hey, little buddy. Whoa, he went inside it. What's this? Oh, he likes that too. We restored some he restored something. Maybe we gotta go in that building. Yeah, it says enter the sunrise temple. That poor spark of light got spooked and flew away. Ah, I really thought we'd bonded too. <laughs> Oh, look, we could go in the home. Augie's fuzzy wuzzy was it there, his imaginary friend slash pet. They had an argument, and now they're not speaking. <laughs> Let's go in this house. My grandpa's cellar is full of secrets. There's a locked chest down there, too, and a strange door, too. Hmm. Let's check it out. Looks like there might be some secrets in here. Oh, the, we can't go down the ladder. Oh, we can. We were just on the wrong side. So we can move this. Is this the treasure chest? Oh, we got a planet coin. Nice. Where's the... Oh, is this the door? This secret wall here? Oops. Press the menu button on accident. Hmm. Well, he said there's a secret door. I'm guessing it's this wall, but I don't have a way to... Maybe we'll get something that'll eventually let us, like, shoot walls or something. Cool. So we'll just have to remember that that's there. We'll come back for it. All right, let's take a look around the town. See what's in this house. Guy's got a nice fire going. I sure hope you can save Beacon Beach. It used to be such a nice planet before that awful dark mess appeared. Just a rabbit hiding in his home. All right, let's see what's up here. Anything cool? This is a way down. What's this guy saying? There's a light activated lock on the lighthouse door, but with these clouds covering the sun, it won't work. Beacon Town flag. You just discovered a new teleport flag. Open the map menu to use it to fast travel around the planet. Nice. Oh, and it unleashed some star bits. Awesome. Oh, a mushroom. Sweet. Super mushroom obtained. We got to remember using uh, items cost an action point too, though. How do we get to the other side of this house? No. 
where these coins are. Oh, those coins are just back. That's where we came up into the town. Yeah, we got to shake every tree. Looks like we can get a lot of stuff from trees. What's this? Oh, one of those uh, cooldown clocks. Let's take a look at this. So this door is going to be locked. need that spark of light inside the temple to unlock this door. It is a lighthouse after all. Get it? I get it, Beepo. It's okay. We'll come back. Okay, let's go down this way. We never went on this side. Shake this tree. Yep. Hey, there's something down there. Let's head down to the beach and go around. Oh, it's another one of those things we can't interact with. This too. What's this guy got to say? Victor, sorry to be a wowser, mates, but all sporting contests are postponed due to weather. So it looks like a lot of stuff will unlock in the town once we get... Oh, cool. Coins. Once we get... um this light tower restored and get the weather back arc of arch of darkness all right let's go in it we could clear this one up arch of dark mess defeat all all right let's see how many we got 11 guys in this battle oh because there's a lot of goombas So what can we do? We could wait for them to come to us. Let's hit it. Okay, first. Let's turbo charge. Got him. Okay, now let's switch to Peachy. Peachy. Can't reach anybody. So let's wait for him to come to us. Let's let's pass our turn here. Cuz I feel like if we run down, we're just going to get exposed, so Yeah, back to us. Okay, here we go. Now we might be able to do something. Let's see. Yeah, we were able to do a dash. Nice. We might be able to hit him from here. Look at that. Yeah. Let's hit this guy. Maybe we'll get a crit hit and take him out. Yeah, we got one. Nice. Got a critical hit. So critical hit is every time you shoot, for those who don't know, you get, um, a, there's a potential for it to do more damage. And it's just a random percentage of every shot you take. Let's heal. I don't know how often we can heal. Can we heal every turn? Oh, looks like there's a three turn cooldown. You see that at the bottom? It shows a timer, then minus three. Okay, that's good to know. No target in range, so let's let's move him over by Rabbit Peach. Oh, we're not gonna be able to hit from here. Let's wait. Oh, here we that's what we'll do. Hero sight. So now if they move this way, we'll automatically shoot him. Alright, let's pass it. Hero sight activated. Oh, yeah. 
All right, let's dash here. Can we dash again? Nope, just the one time. We can't hit him. So let's head over here to keep us out of range. And we'll switch to Peach. Take him out. And I think we're good here. We're going to pass it back again. Oh, now we're only under partial cover, though. But we can vault over this. Dash. Boom. Now you're in trouble, buddy. Sleepy time. That's sleepy time. That was a good battle. Well played. We finished with full health. Okay, Arc of Dark Mess. Complete. And we got another planet coin. Thanks for clearing that puddle. Unfortunately, the tentacle on the lighthouse is still affecting the weather. Yeah, I know. We're going to fix it. We're going to fix it. Don't you worry, buddy. So let's see exactly... Where, uh, how do we get to the map again? I think it was minus, maybe. Yep. bob -omb Hunt. There it is. That's where we need to go. What's this bob -omb Hunt? bob -omb's ruin everything. Oh, you know, there was stuff we could buy. Hey, we could shake bushes, too. Nothing in that one. Get a couple of coins here. We were able to buy some stuff with star coins. Remember? Or planet coins, they're called. Put the pedal to the metal with these championship caliber Speedway Slingers. Speedway Dukes. Look sharp. Sharpshooter. Iconic. Vintage piece prompts unforgettable jaw-dropping style moments from friends and foes alike. So we could level up sparks. Hmm. Might unlock some atypical door on Beacon Beach. Oh, that one costs seven coins. That's the one we really want. So let's save up. Let's save up planet coins for that one. We need seven planet coins. So it looks like we could maybe get one from some kind of adventure here. I got a great deal on this vacation package. Now I know why this place is crawling with bob -omb's. I'm more stressed than when I left. Would you get rid of at least three of them? I could really use the rest and relaxation. Hunt down bob -omb's. So here's one. So we'll get a planet coin if we uh, take out all the bomb bombs on this planet. Okay, let's go for it. How many do we have? Five of them. Oh, there's two guys over here, I see. All right, I know just what to do. We're going to bomb them. Ho oh. ho. Let's see. If we stand here, we could probably shoot them both. So one there, one there. Nice. Okie dokie. All right, let's um Will this affect her? Yeah, there we go. Now we'll switch to Peach, Rabbit Peach. Is that all of them? Yeah, battle cleared. <laughs> she makes a heart. Collecting those coins and star bits. So we got one bob -omb down. We need to find two more. 
Anybody see any more bob hey. running around? I know we need to go in that temple, too. Here, bomb bombs. Hold X to boost. Yeah, I don't. I know that one. Maybe in town we'll find one. Well, I don't see any more right now. I think we'll just go to the Sunrise Temple. Hopefully the one we got already counts towards the quest or will stay counted towards the quest when we're done with this temple. Ooh, some coins hidden behind it. Nice. Let's get these coins too. All right, coming around the front door, the Sunrise Temple. Here we go. Crossing the Battleground, this one's called. Okay, so we need to get to the area at the end there. So we got to move forward while we're playing here. Oh, it's a spark, a fire spark. Pyro Star. You gotta win this battle so I can leave with you, else I'm stuck here. You know, we were following a different spark earlier, but ha, the more the merrier. <laughs> Here's a tip. The bad guys on this particular battlefield are pretty apathetic. Get to the other end of the battlefield and they'll just give up. Hmm. So just getting the end will win the battle. By pressing the left joystick, Beepo is able to move around the battlefield and analyze both heroes and enemies. You can browse between them using left and right. Each time you count encounter new enemies, remember to analyze them. It will help to understand their abilities and behaviors. Cool. So. Oh, so this. So if you press A on them, it analyzes them. And it shows you all their stats and what they're weak to. Like these Goombas are weak to looks like pretty much everything. Typically attacks in groups where they seek to get close enough to opponents and use their dash. And you could flip them over. Let's see. These are the new guys though. They're called Scopers. Highly mobile with a long range two shot attack. They're weak to fire and they're resistant to frost. Okay, so these guys must have a long range shot. All right, let's let's start the battle. Took the Goombas out. Might as well start shooting these guys. Since we're behind cover. Let's power up Peach. Peachy, peachy, peachy. Let's start here. Oh, leaving so soon. Leaving so soon. <laughs> oh, this guy's coming up on us. Uh oh. You got Mario. All right, I got an idea. There we go. That wasn't enough to take him out yet, though. All right, let's go to Mario. Let's dash up. Right here looks good. Got him with one of those. Oh, yeah. oh, we could use Hero Sight, too. I don't know that they're going to try and move up on us, though. But if they do, maybe Mario will shoot him. 
All right, let's pass it over to these guys now. Oh, yeah, he tried to move. Got him. Okay, Mario. Um, let's move you up here. Now we'll switch to Peachy. You might as well heal. Mario needs some health. Let's keep them keep them tapped off, right? Okay, let's pass it to the enemy's turn. Okay, now let's go with Mario. This guy's done. You're toast, Scoper. So we could pass to the enemy, but we're right by the we're right by the goal. Battle cleared. All right, we did it. Leveled up to level four. Nice. Oh, we got some skill prisms, it said, too. So we could upgrade some of our skills. Pyrostar joins the team. A new spark just joined your team. Equip it in the spark menu and have it ready to fight alongside your heroes. This is the spark management screen. Here you can assign any spark that joined your team to one of your heroes. In this area, you can check the power and bonus granted by the spark. Choose your sparks wisely. Each of them has a peculiar power that could help you in each battle. So this Pyro Star says all weapon-based attacks are charged with a burn super effect and deal 120% fire damage. Ah, and all super effect damage is reduced by 20% and we're not affected by burn damage. So if somebody tries to burn us while you're equipped with the spark or you use the spark, it won't hurt you. Okay, press X to access the upgrade screen. Here you can feed sparks with star bits and star potions. Okay, so this spark. Let's put him on Peach. I like it. I like this one. And we can't upgrade Starburst yet, so let's let's do an upgrade on this one. How many star bits do we have? Does it show? Oh, we have 282. So we could level them up. Sweet. All right, now let's go to the team or heroes. Let's go to the oh weapon skins. So Luigi has the archer. He's got the dukes. Mario has the slinger. Okay. I don't think they had new skins though, right? Oh, we got a new one for Mario. Mega Bug Dual Slingers are pre-ordering for what price? <laughs> cool. So we have two upgrades. Let's go to Peach and let's... So this is increasing glide time. Landing heal, so... Oh, you can get two extra dashes too eventually. Technique. We can increase the heal effect. I like that. I thought I had two sparks, though. Oh, this one costs two, though. That's why I use both of them. Let's increase her critical hit chance. Oh, I didn't want it to 60. How do I make this? Oh, this goes to 20. This goes to 60. So that means 40 is the current one. Now this one we could do increase our weapon range. So I like that. Let's do that one too.
Perfect. Oh, did that say I had another one still? Hold on, let's go back. Yeah, there's still one more. Now, can I use it on Mario? Oh, Mario has two, so they each have their own. I see. Ah, okay. All right, let's do a health one. Is there a way to switch heroes while I'm in here? I don't think so. All right, let's go to Mario. Uh, weapon damage, we could increase hero sight damage, critical hit damage, weapon range. Glide boost. Oh, I like this one. Ten, uh, heal 15% after a battle. And this one is increase mm -hmm. healing restoration by 10%. I'm going to go with the movement, though. We still got one more. Let's go with the healing restored. Okay, moving right along here. Let's get these bits and head into this temple. Oh man, here we go. Does he see something? Uh-oh, he sees a bad guy. Who is this guy? <laughs> He's scary. He must be scary. All right, everybody, we're going to end this first video here. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you press the like button and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you in the next video.